In this video, I'm going to show you how you should check your own testicles, which you should be doing every month from the start of puberty. This can be a really effective way of getting to know this area of your body and potentially detecting testicular cancer at an early and very curable stage. So the first thing people often ask is when should I do self-examination? So examining your testicles is best performed after a warm bath or shower, and that's because heat will relax the scrotum, and that is the sac of skin that supports the testicles and it'll make it easier to spot anything that is abnormal. In terms of how you do the exam, you want to do it standing up and check one testicle at a time. So I'm going to demonstrate here how to check the testicle and to do this, we're going to use this set of cherries. So imagine these are your testicles. You want to examine one at a time. So you want to start off by anchoring the testicle at the back with the middle finger and the index finger and the thumbs. And you want to roll the testicle in between your fingers. And to do this, you can then feel if there's a lump on the surface of the testicle. And you want to work your way around the whole testicle just to make sure there are no lumps at all. Once you've done it on one side, you can move on to the other side. Now you might also find the epididymis, which is the soft tube-like structure behind the testicle that collects and carries sperm. If you're familiar with this structure, then you won't mistake it for a suspicious lump. Now cancerous lumps are usually found on the sides of the testicle and they're typically not painful, but they can show up anywhere on the testicle. Now, what should you do if you do find an abnormality? Now, if you find a lump or swelling or changes in size or consistency of the testicle, so for example, one might be harder, you should make an appointment to see your doctor. Now, importantly, most swellings and lumps in the scrotum are not due to cancer. There are various other causes, so things like hydrocele, cysts, and swollen veins, and you can find other videos about these conditions on this channel. However, you should always tell your doctor if you've discovered a swelling or lump in one of your testicles and and it will need checking out as soon as possible. Now you should also look out for the following signs and symptoms and contact your doctor if you do notice any of these. And these are enlargement of a testicle, significant loss of size in one of the testicles, a feeling of heaviness in the scrotum, a dull ache in the lower abdomen or the groin, a sudden collection of fluid in the scrotum, or pain or discomfort in a testicle or the scrotum that's not going away. Remember, if you're in doubt, get it checked out, if only for peace of mind, and for more information, check out the links in the description box of the video.